this is Cynthia Chapman and I just wanted to give you a little peek inside of my set bag to show you some of the products that I like to use on set. This is some Orbe dry shampoo, um, hairspray by Kerastase, little oil from Daviness. Oh, this is another dry shampoo. It's really good for just, if you have someone with thin hair, to plump it up and make it look thicker. Dry shampoo is so good. Um, Evian water spray. A wax stick. And this is a hair palette. If you add alcohol, you can mix like I did here. Um, mix the colors with alcohol and you can use it for light cover-ups. If somebody has a few grays or they have a streak of green hair that's not appropriate for the character, you have a small color correction you have to do. The hair palette is awesome. Then I have some hair fibers. This is one that's a little bit more expensive, but it's true to color. You can p actually pick this brand up at Sally's. It's Topics. And I put it in an atomizer and it's great for if someone has thin edges or a balding spot, you can just puff it into that area and it thickens it up really good and just makes it look more camera, camera ready. Also, something I'm starting to do I've had actors that have allergens, gluten allergens, you know, they don't want sulfate or any allergens, allergy-free free hair products. If you go to Whole Foods, they are starting to carry some really nice items. And I'm just starting to carry a couple just in those events. It's just a smart idea because you never know when you're going to come across that person who does have a gluten or whatever allergy they don't want it even in their their hair products I look forward to seeing you at our class and we'll talk more <laughs>